Yo, what's going on guys? I am back again and today I'm going to show you how to scaffer mine to make money. So I was gone because I was in England, but right now I'm back in Germany and after that I was sick for two weeks. So yeah, let's just jump right into the basics. Also, quick intermission, don't forget to like and subscribe because I'm going to hit 1k very soon. Thank you guys. So what you're going to need is first of all some kind of a pickaxe or a drill or the best thing that you probably can get is the gauntlet right here the gemstone gauntlet because it gives you 1600 mining speed which is more than enough to break hearthstone in one hit so you just need to have 1.5k mining speed to insta break it and i don't want to see any one of you guys using pico Numbuses and wasting all of their money if you do that i'm not going to let you join my guild which is by the way called Galatasaray, so if you want to join it, uh, then just send the invite request. Also, I don't know if you know that football team, but they are playing today, so don't forget to root for them, guys. <laughs> so yeah, as I was saying, you going to need a drill or something of that kind. Then the next thing that you want to get is Sorrow Armor, because if you use Sorrow, as you can see, you get that 5 magic find per piece, which is adding up to 20, which is very good. And then what you also want to put on it is Renown because it gives you a plus 1% magic find. So as you can see, I'm gaining 4% more um, magic find. <laughs> then the next thing that you want to get as a pet should be the Black Cat pet. I think you can also use a G-Drake, but you need a very high gold collection for it to be worth it. So just go with the Black Cat. Costs 50 million, kind of expensive. But worth it because as you can see it gives the stats as like a pet stat or I don't know what's it called. Just put on it a lucky clover and as you can see 22 magic find and 15 pet like really really good. So let's just equip it. And the last thing that you want to buy yourself is a Daedalus X which costs 23 million as you can see right there. So you should just get it because it's really really cheap and together with the black cat pet it just takes its stats and just doubles it. Again, which is really nice. If you're really rich, put Chimera on it, but Chimera is like 100 mil per book. Yeah, as you can see, over 100 million per book. And another thing that most people overlook is Divine Gift, which basically just gives you 6 magic finds at the highest rarity. Which is, I mean, 6 magic finds is 6 magic finds. And on a Daedalus X, it's not uh, wasted. So this should be the setup that you want. Also, of course, you want to use a booster cookie and a god pot, but I don't think that I have to cover that. So my magic find that I am getting right now is... So the magic find that I'm getting right now is a hundred... Oh, wait. A hundred eighty-nine. But that's not it. Because if you go into beast cherry... Oh, whoops. It's called worm, isn't it? Yeah. I'm gaining an extra 33 magic find from Beast Race, so over 200 magic find. And this method actually works because I don't know if you have seen it, but I've dropped a scaffold pad, which is really nice. And I'm just going to show you how it is done. So all that you have to do is also go into your hotem and disable... What's it called? Wait, right here. You want to disable mole because it's not good to use mole while doing the strategy and then just go somewhere like here and then start digging in a straight line and the best way to do this is while going around the edges of the map so let me just go there so while i'm going there i can show you a little trick and um, just go into your controls and bind walk forward from w to right mouse button so all you just have to do is hold on left and right mouse button and then you can do this like a bit afk so you just have to leave one hand on the mouse and with the other one you can i don't know what you're doing with that hand man. but it's semi afk i would say and if the worm is spawning just switch to your day x and then start hitting it till it dies and as you can see a scaffold just spawned and then i'm just going to go ahead and kill it and as you can see, just like that, really easy. I have just got another scaffold. Okay? No pet, but I think right around with my magic find, 
the chance to drop a blue pet, which I've got, is like 1 in 63 or something. So, I mean, it's not that common, but also not impossible to get. So, this is the easiest way to do scaffer farming. Tell me if I forgot anything, but I think this is most of it. And yeah, as I said, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm really close to 1k. I would hope that you've enjoyed this video. And maybe leave a comment, do what you want, and I'm going to catch you in the next one. Bye, guys.